In this video, we're going to talk about what causes a blank display to appear on an ATV61 and 71 drives. So the blank display problem can appear for a number of reasons. Um, the most common one is where a keypad is bad. And the best place to really confirm that is to remove the keypad from your drive. All right, and uh, yeah, actually that's a good point. Actually, I'm glad this is going to show you this. On some drives, you have a port right here. That's where the keypad goes. Um, you also have a built-in display on some drives. If you don't have it, it's okay. Don't, you know, don't stress out. It's all right. Now, if this is working and if the keypad, if you want to connect it and hear it click, if it doesn't work, then that definitely could be a keypad issue. If you have power applied and if your um, display right here doesn't work either if this is blank then we're looking at a bigger problem um, at that point what you want to do is uh, is to measure your both your 24 volt terminals right here and your 10 volt supply terminals right here the leftmost right here and the 24 volt right here so um, you have to get a meter you have to measure 24 terminal DC again of course and the temple supply DC as well and see what you're getting from uh, those points to common. If you have a cable that's connected to this drive, to the keypad, with the cable between them, then I would recommend taking that cable out and putting the keypad directly on the drive like this and see if the keypad works that way. And this is assuming there's no problems with your 2410 and temple supplies. That's also assuming your display actually works, the drive is operating fine, it assumes only the keypad is the main problem. So you can try to take the cable out and mount it directly on the, on the front of the drive like this. Um, and if for some reason the 24 or the 10 volt is missing or if this is blank, again, it's, this might be a drive issue where it could be a power board or control board. Um, at that point, I would recommend calling us to see what the main problem could be. But um, again, uh, for our purposes here, again, this keypad does work, and you have to just click on it right there, and it should power up without any kind of problems. And this is basically what you can do to confirm uh, what's causing your blank display on power up of a 6 to 1 or 7 to 1 drive. 